Hello everyone, this is Mr. Informal. I did a episode review of Dragon Ball Super 130, so check that out, check it out on my channel. All I can say is that episode is instant classic, but we gotta talk about something that is something we do not see, especially, I mean specially, in Jiren's case. In episode Dragon Ball Super episode 130, there is a scene where Powered Up Jiren basically throws a ball, beam balls or ball beams to Universe 7. Not Goku, but Universe 7. The warriors that were eliminated from the tournament were sitting down just watching this fight go down and he basically throws a ball to them and luckily Goku so fast blocked it sent it away somewhere else and it really got me thinking what was the point of that what is Jiren trying to prove well I already know what he's trying to prove he's basically saying all this friendship, this loyalty, this relationship is nothing. It's all about ultimate power because they all disappear. And I get what he's saying. Obviously, I get what Goku's saying too because we've seen Goku time and time again go through these things. And as you know, Jiren also has pride. So, why would Jiren go that low just to prove a point? I mean, I, I, out of all the warriors, I would have never expected that. I mean, I was expecting Universe 9, Universe 2, or some other universe to even do that. But for Jiren, of all the universes, would do that. That's quite uncharacteristic of him especially his personality traits but then again we're just trying to slowly understand how he is and in this case we suddenly see that he will basically just throw you off just so he can prove a point and this you know the funny thing is is that this doesn't this doesn't um this reminds me of Frieza, Vegeta, except Cell. But of all the enemies that Goku had to face, they basically do, did all of those things. And Jiren is not even an enemy. He's just basically he's there to make sure that he wins the tournament for his universe or else his universe is gonna get wiped out, which you know you can't really blame him he has to do what he has to do and if he needs to throw you off then he might do that just for just to win but I don't think he did that just to win I think he did that just to prove his point basically friends come and go but ultimate ultimate power does not and that was just surprising and I'm sure we'll get to know more about Jiren, hopefully in the future. And uh, maybe he changed. Maybe he, it'll be like Naruto versus Gara, where Gara suddenly changed after the whole tournament. And so, let me know down in the comments below what you think, why Jiren did that, or if you have some theories, you have an idea of, as to why. Let me know down in the comments below. And so I will see you in the next Dragon Ball Super content. This is Mr. Informal signing out. Bye-bye.